Hello YouTube, welcome to another video. Here we have the Lenovo Legion 5 with the 300 watt adapter that shipped with it. Can it work with a 230 watt adapter? That's what we're gonna see in this video. And both are slim pin adapters. So as you can notice here, so it's the same uh, adapter at the end, but a 230 watt versus 300 watt. Will it work with the Legion 5? With the Ryzen 7 5800H and NVIDIA RTX 3060 graphics. So also we are going to check out with the 65 watt USB type C adapter. So this laptop also supports USB C PD or the power delivery. So first let's have uh, let's set up a baseline. So this is the 300 watt adapter that I got with this particular laptop. So it's quite heavy and let's check out let's connect this uh, power break to the power supply. So as you can see the power supply indicator is lit up with the 300 watt adapter now. So we are going to do a baseline test. Well, the reason for this video is that there are many such questions out on Reddit and Quora and other such platforms that can I use a 230 watt adapter with this Lenovo Legion 5 that came with a 300 watt adapter one. So that question we are going to answer and also we are going to see if it can work with the USB type C adapter. So right now I am running GTA 5. As you can notice, the game is running around 80 to 85 frames per second and the GPU is taking around 115 to 120 watt and the CPU it's taking around 33 to 35 watt. So this is normal with the 300 watt adapter. So right now I am using the 230 watt adapter and as you can notice there is absolutely no difference. So the CPU GPU is taking almost the same amount of wattage and also the frames I am getting almost the same 80 85 frames. So which is really good. Now let's test out another game. So this is Forza Horizon 5. So first let's check out with the 300 watt adapter. So as you can notice this game it's using considerably less resource than the previous GTA 5. So here it's taking around 90 to 100 watts for the GPU and the CPU it's taking around 25 to 30 watt. So with this uh, with the 300 watt adapter there is no uh, hitches. So right now let's test with the 230 watt adapter so as you can notice there is absolutely no drop in the frames earlier also we were getting around 80 85 frames per second so right now even with the 230 watt adapter we are getting the same frames and even the cpu and gpu power consumption is almost the same so there is absolutely no difference with both the adapters so with this we are clear even the 230 watt adapter can power this ryzen 7 5800h and the 3060 graphics so this is the full blown 130 watt rtx 3060 graphics so it can run uh, quite smoothly so there is no power issues or something like that but we are going to check out one more thing so that is with the usb type c adapter so this particular legion 5 the previous generation model the 2021 model so it supports only up to 90 watts with the usb type c power delivery so with this 65 watt adapter as you can notice uh, the frame it's dropped below 20 30 so it's not playable so you can reduce the uh, settings so you can reduce from ultra to uh, low or medium settings and you can run so basically with the 65 watt adapter so you can use it for just uh, charging this laptop so nothing more than that and also like if you are using it for some uh, lighter applications so only then it can be used so as you can notice even with this charger is plugged in but the charging is pretty slow with this uh, 65 watt adapter so if you are charging it overnight so then it will do or if you are doing some lighter uh, web applications or uh, you are watching some youtube video netflix or something like that so in that case it can cope up with the charging but again i don't recommend that so you can get the 230 watt adapter instead or if you already have it you can use the same so right now i am running gta 5 so this time i have not connected to any adapter and i am still getting the 25 to 30 frames that i got with the 65 watt adapter so there is absolutely no difference if you connect a, a lower power charger so as you can notice i haven't connected to power outlet i am still getting the same amount of frames that i got with this smaller 65 watt adapter so to conclude if you don't want to use this 300 watt adapter and if you want to use the smaller 230 watt adapter you can go ahead with that but the 65 watt adapter it don't do it 
and also if you uh, have the apple 90 watt adapter so i have tried with that uh, the macbook pro adapter so even with that I, I am not able to play the game so right now i don't have it with me but i have tested that and with that also we cannot play any games with this particular laptop and coming to the heat so as you can notice the 300 watt it, it's a bit more uh, less heat than the 230 watt one so i don't know maybe because it's a older charger so the 230 watt it heats up much faster than the 300 watt and i have another pro tip here so if you want to hide your big ugly chargers so you can get one of these wire pins and you can put all the cable the adapter everything into this and you can just have this wire outside so you can charge your laptop so thank you for watching subscribe for more videos like this and as always stay safe and peace